All right, just a quick little monologue, I guess, is what I might just call this, these kind of on-the-spot videos. Uh, in this case, it's once again dealing with the Quranic delirium started by Muhammad, and also the fact of the Islamic persecution of the saints, of God's saints. Because the truth of the matter is, is that this has been uh, said many times before in my videos, but of course Genesis 16, verse 11 and 12, talks about Ishmael, and he will be a wild man against every man, and that is certainly fulfilled by his spiritual descendants, the Muslims. Hence why I call this Ishmaelite Quranic delirium. Or you could just call it Islamic Quranic delirium because it's the same thing. This uh, Ishmaelite Islamic type of ideology is one of the biggest enemies. Essentially, Roman Catholicism and Ishmaelite Quranic Islamic delirium is what I'm referring to this thing as. And uh, basically, communism in this day and age are essentially the biggest persecutors of the saints. And over in Nigeria or places like uh, Pakistan or whatever else, the Ishmaelite Islamic delirium, the Quranic delirium, is essentially on a on a path uh, on some kind of holy, you know, unholy jihad against God's saints. Over in Nigeria, it's basically just epidemic proportions of Islamic genocide against the saints of God. Because why? Well, because Ishmael will be a wild man against every man. Okay, uh, Islam was started by a devil possessed, a, a whoremongering, fornicating, polygamist pedophile under the influence of Jesuit Roman Catholic Augustinian monks, by the way. But the Jesuits influenced it today. But the Augustinian monks, they were who, they were who uh, mentored Muhammad. And of course the Jesuits, because of course they didn't exist back then, I, I just want to correct that. But they have since been using Islam as basically to fulfill their Antichrist agenda. And Islam is of the spirit of Antichrist. And again, this, this mass genocide against the saints of God just mirrors the kind of stuff you'd see from the Jesuits during the Middle Ages. Because what? Well, it's the daughter of the of the uh, harlot, the Quranic, Ish, the Ishmaelite Islamic Quranic delirium started by the devil possessed whoremongering false prophet, is just another daughter of Mystery Babylon, i.e., the Roman Catholic Church, and the type of uh, uh, aggressive, violent bar barbarism you see from Islam over in places like Nigeria, Uganda, or you know Pakistan or whatnot. Uh, it's just mimicking the type of barbarism you saw from the Jesuits and the Roman Catholic Church, or that you would read about when they would persecute God's saints. And the uh, Islamic, uh, uh, sorry, the Quranic delirium started by Muhammad is, like I said, one of the biggest enemies of the saints of God and the spreading of the gospel. Plain and simple, it's a, the spirit of Antichrist. Islam is a false religion. It's 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 a ticket to hell. I'll put it that way. So just. I wanted to point that out. Genesis 16, verse 11 and 12, Proverbs 8, verse 36, and John 8, 44 tell me everything I need to know about the satanic, devil possessed whoremonger Muhammad and also his uh, Islamic, Quranic, Ishmaelite delirium he started under the influence of Augustinian monks. So may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye. Thank you.